Hello everyone. Welcome to Qubit classes. In this video, we will see how the set which has been written in the set builder form can be written in the roster form or list form. Let's do this by solving a couple of examples. For example, consider the first example which says the set of all those values of x such that x is a letter of the word marriage now one important thing to understand before solving this problem is a set cannot have duplicate elements thus if i write down all the alphabets which have been used in the word marriage those will be m a R, I, G, and E. So you guessed it right. I have skipped one R and one A because both A and R are coming twice. Therefore, this set in the roster form will be inside the curly braces and separated by commas. Remember. So the first letter will be A, or other element, then A. R, I, G, and E. So, if you want, you can write them in alphabetical order, but this is perfectly fine. So, this set has one, two, three, four, five, six elements. So, it is a finite set. Note that uh, the elements of this set are not numbers but letters. Now, let's move on to another problem, which says. Write this set in the roster form. The set of all x's such that x is an integer which lies between minus one by two and nine by two. So first step should be writing down minus one by two and nine by two in their decimal formats. So minus one by two will be minus point five, and nine by two will be four point five. Okay. Now I want to start from minus point five, and I want to go to the right hand side of the real number line. So the immediate integer which is greater than minus point five is zero. Then one, then two, three, and four. So I am not writing down the next integer which is five because. The condition mentioned in the problem is x should be less than nine by two or four point five. So this particular set will have five elements, which will be zero, one, two, three, and four. So five elements. Now both these examples had a, a finite number of elements, six and five respectively. Now let's uh, solve another problem. This is slightly complicated, which says find all those values of x such that x is two n and n is the set of natural numbers. So first of all, let us write down the set of natural numbers, which is an infinite set. Remember, so this will be one. Add one to the previous one, so it will be two, then three, four, five, and so on. Now the condition on x is it should be twice the element which belongs to the set of natural numbers. So if I consider one, then two n will be two. If I consider two, then two n will be sorry, then two n will be four. If I consider uh, three, then two n will be six. So if I go on writing this, I will get eight, then ten, and so on. Thus, I am getting the set of all even natural numbers, which are two, four, six, eight, so. So this will be our required set. I note this is an infinite set.
that's all about the roaster for thank you